Hello, welcome to this video of the uh, Nissan Juke, the 1.5 DCI. We'll get straight into the action with this one. Uh, condition of the vehicle. Let's start on this uh, this corner here. This corner, very tidy. Alloy wheel, very clean. All the tyres are good. All the arches are nice and clean. Well, that corner is very tidy there, there's no damage on that corner, the lights are nice and clear, uh, it's got the uh, tinted glass, all the bumper is uh, quite tidy, a little tiny bit of a scuff just there that's been touched in, that's all to report, pure drive, Roof's very clean. That arch is very clean as well. Alloy wheel very good. All the tyres are all good. That door nice and clean. No tar spots on the paintwork, all nice and clean. Edge of the wing mirror very clean as well. Front screen. Very clean. That wing, very clean. That arch, very clean. That alloy wheel, in excellent condition. Front end's very clean as well. LED lights, lower fog lights as well at the bottom, LED daytime running lights, there your headlights, xenon. The original Nissan windscreen, very clean condition, very very slight surface chip there on that side of the screen, just one very very light one, back of that wing mirror very clean. That door, immaculate. And that rear door, immaculate as well. All the A-pillars, that's all nice and shiny there. The front of the roof, that's nice and clean. Let's go to the back. Open that up. We are missing the parcel shelf. So I'm trying to locate the parcel shelf for this. There should be one by the time you get here. So that's missing the parcel shelf. Okay, it's got a variable boot floor. So it means that uh, piece of board can come up and it can sit on that top tier there or it can sit at the bottom. So that's a variable boot floor. Down here you've got the uh, tyre compressor and foam kit, the locking wheel nut, etc. That's all there. This is all nice and clean, the plastic. Back to the seats are nice and clean. Split fold rear seats, 60 40 split, of course. Around the uh, edges are very uh, nice and clean. And up here, that's nice and clean as well. So, grab handle there to grab that down. Rear door. Okay. Rear door is very clean. Inside's very clean, the Alcantara uh, and cloth interior. And then all this is nice and clean here, the door shuts, etc. Got uh, three full size uh, seat belts and it's got three rear headrests as well in the back here. Look, three headrests, three full size uh, seat belts. It's also got the child Isofix anchoring points as well for the kiddie seats. And it's all nice and clean. There's a magazine. Uh, Holder this side, not on that side though, just on this side. It's all nice and clean, all the plastic and the arches here, very clean. No scratches on the door handles there. Electric rear windows, clean bottle holders there. All the door shuts are nice and clean. Passengers front, all nice and clean. No scratches on the handle there. 
speaker grills are immaculate, all the door shuts are immaculate, all the bits down there are nice and clean, all down here is nice and clean as well. Passenger seat, very good condition. No cigarette burns, it doesn't smell of cigarettes and it doesn't smell of dogs either. It's all nice and clean. This is all nice and clean as well, the armrest. Nice and firm, not saggy. No scratches on that there. Four electric windows, all the handle, all that area there is nice and clean. Inside the door pockets, the speaker grill, all the foot pedals, they're nice and clean. All the door shuts, all that area there. The driver's seat is in good condition. It's got two keys as well. This. So we've got the two remote central locking keys there. We've got electric mirrors as well. Uh, then you've got your uh, little buttons here, traction control, stop start, etc. It's going to get in now, close the door. Right, that's better. So, inside multifunctional uh, leather steering wheel with the red stitching. Very sporty looking. Uh, buttons everywhere. Source, info, volume, uh, Bluetooth. Uh, what's that one? That's cruise control, resume, etc. Uh, today, 55,490. 85 miles till empty. Uh, idling very healthily uh, this has got the sat nav of course uh, it's also got the USB uh, down here and the aux as well USB etc and six speed and reverse reverse camera as well so reverse camera as well it's a very high spec it's got the leather six speed gear lever so six speed there it's the gear lever which is leather stitched in the red stitching as well and all this fancy red um, high gloss red trim everywhere uh, leather a little bit of a leather extended leather cover there for the speedometer up there with the silver surrounds very sporty looking uh, and then obviously the headlights there which obviously the front fog lights as well uh, this has got climate control as you can see there it's all digital as well uh, what else can you do if you press that there press that for the camera show guidelines on and off CD no CD and so of course map for the sat nav obviously that's for the menu the radio etc so that's all there right what's over here let's have a look armrest up and down little coin tray storage inside the armrest nice and clean we've got the gloved box uh, what else have you got you've got the uh, first aid kit in there a little bag for the locking wheel note as well a spare bag uh, then you've also got the uh, booklet here, the logbook, the service history. Now this logbook currently is in the trade name. We're trying to get it out because the last lady that sold it, uh, sold it to the trade garage in Chesterfield. That's where we've got it from. And she's put, she sent the logbook off. So we need to get that back down to two keepers because it's showing three former keepers now. So that needs to go. It's got the service history. It's got uh, the last few years service injury invoiced as well. Uh, 50, oh look at that, 54,000 miles, uh, full service, fit bottom arm. So the MOT had an advisor of a bottom arm, which was done. Ball joint, bottom arm. Uh, all these invoices for the last few years servicing. Listed the uh, fuel filter as well, freight test report, battery, uh, minor service. Uh, that was that, yeah, that was that ball joint there, that was good, done. That was done, so the MOT was done on the, uh, I think it was first, that's it. Uh, date of test, 31st of the 10th, and it was done on the 17th of the 1st, that one. So it's all got the previous MOTs, are all there. We've got the service booklet with all the stamps in as well. Uh, I think we've got one missing for the year, it was COVID. Um, but all the stamps are in the book. Uh, there's one missing for one of the COVID years there. So we've got two, four, six, six stamps there. Two keys, HPI clear as well. And like we said, the timing belt's not due until 90,000 miles on this vehicle or eight years. So it's got about a year and three months left on the time. 
and it's got about 35,000 miles left on the uh, miles. Okay, so let's switch the engine off and switch it back on again so you can see all the lights come on on the dash, everything lights up, and then uh, start it up, count to three, all the lights go out, just leaving the handbrake light and the seatbelt light. That's it. So you do that once again, off, on. So all the lights go off, apart from that, just that one seat belt and handbrake. Okay, down here, we've got the toggles, one for the fuel cap, one for the bonnet. So this is diesel, 100% diesel. It's not, it's not add blue, this one, no. It's just diesel, this one. It's not add blue, this is the, uh, this is the Renault engine. So this is the Renault. It shares the same engine as the Renault. So Renault, Nissan uh, and Mercedes-Benz share this engine. So this is the 1.5 uh, DCI. So it's also in the Mercedes A-classes. Um, it's also obviously in the Renault range as well. And the Nissan. Uh, good to see it's got a proper size battery as well. The correct wattage. Uh, it's all nice and clean. It's got the correct fluid, um, which is the uh, green. Green antifreeze on these. Not the red, the green. So Renault, renowned, renowned for the green, Renault Nissan. So uh, the dipstick is in the uh, cap there. This is turbocharged as well. The turbocharger is right at the back. It's all very clean and tidy. HPI clear. So not involved in any accidents or uh, insurance claims, should we say. Okay, if you've got a part exchange, please let us know the reg number and mileage, and I'll give you a quotation based on the Auto Trader live data. And then uh, we do the finance. We're FCA registered. We've got our own in-house finance team led by James. So James will uh, give you a quotation on the finance based on your credit score. This vehicle could be financed up to five years. So if you'd like to uh, take out the finance, you've got five years to pay it off. Okay, so any more questions, please do not hesitate to ask us. I hope you enjoyed the video and hope to see you soon. Thank you.